Aloha! This is Food and Fitness with Ho'o from HolisticFit.com, the blog and courses for holistic lifestyle and home of the book, Walk in Beauty. Today, I'm going to show you how to do something that's super important, and that is meal planning. Okay, so to meal plan, I'm going to show you the formula that I use and that I teach others, and this is actually part of the planner book that I created, um, and it's on HolisticFit.com. It's what I use when I'm working with clients, and it really helps us to get a, a good idea of healthy foods that we should be eating. Now, meal prepping, the importance of it is that it will prevent you from making um, poor choices, especially when we're hungry, we make the worst choices ever. So the formula is choosing one meal as your base and then coming up with variations. Today, it's going to be a meat wrap, a turkey meat wrap, and I have an orange and a smoothie that's going to accompany that. So we're going to come up with three variations. One is going to be slaw with yogurt, and then I'm going to have onions, of course. If you stay tuned to the end, you'll see the food demo for this. And then I'm going to have another one that's going to be a cream, che cream cheese. <laughs> Almost didn't know how to say that. Cream cheese, and then again the slaw, and then of course the onions for flavor. And then the final one is going to, I'm going to kind of switch it up a bit and do a sweet kind of honey mustard slaw and then of course add the onions for the flavor what I just created and showed you is basically my shopping list so easy right you're gonna pull all those ingredients down to the bottom and then just write it out for a really simple shopping list that way when you go to the store you buy exactly what you need and you don't buy a lot of other things that could harm your um, your health journey I guess you know that way we're not walking out with bags of chips and other things right so writing down this menu is super helpful when shopping and then choose the grain wrap of your choice there's so many variations out there and as you can see I, I like to draw and doodle every so often because it kind of makes the pages fun so it's a lot of things you can add to make um, planning meal planning a bit more interesting I also like to add a little bit of washi tape as you can see, I've added some to the bottom of my meal plan. And then I um, drew pictures throughout that kind of um, connect with what I'm eating or what I'm doing. And I'm also going to add a couple more little embellishments throughout this. Now, washi tape is one of those fun things. Um, it's like you can't have enough. You just got to make sure you use it. You know, you don't want to just collect it. You want to use it. And what's really fun is in my newsletter and when you subscribe, on, on my YouTube channel, you're going to see how I not only use washi tape, but how I incorporate a lot of creative ideas into the holistic lifestyle to make things that would seem mundane and boring to make it more interesting. So instead of just doing a boring meal plan, we're kind of livening it up with some, you know, doodles and some washi tape, making it more fun so that you'll have a better experience. So now that we've created this list, you know what's next? Yep, let's do it. We're going to go and create the meal so you can see an example. So here's the basic ingredients. The slaw, of course. Um, really nice. It's like broccoli and kale and some other goodies in there. And then my yogurt of choice is, is this delicious yogurt. I love, love, love it. Find it on online. It's so tasty and creamy. I can't even explain it. But that's a, a natural. It's the natural flavor. So there's no um, sweetener or anything added into it. You just want a base. And I use my yogurt kind of like a glue. The same way I would use the cream cheese, kind of like a glue. And then you build it from there. You put on your meat. I obviously like a lot of turkey in there. And then you're going to put on your greens. For me, I want to have flavor in every bite. So I kind of um, make sure it's evenly spread out. You don't want to put too much in there because you don't want it to burst. And you don't have to go too crazy with this. You know, keep it simple. Um, you can do variations, of course. This is one meal and then you can do a couple more wraps one after the other the thing about wrapping is to tuck and roll so the whole time you're pulling in the ends and then tucking and rolling and then boom you're done it's really that simple i, I mean after this one i was like oh i'm gonna make more and make more and that's why you can come up with the variation so you would do this kind of on a sunday to meal prep for the rest of your week right for your your monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday and this will help you stick to your meal plan that way you know little temptations won't get in your way and then what you're seeing now is i'm going to use uh, washi tape 
course some fun embellishment and I chose the the love you washi tape and then I'm gonna kind of add it and I'm gonna wrap my my meat roll and what I actually used was a butcher paper super simple easy to buy you can get loads of them and same idea tuck and roll tuck and roll and then when you get close to the edge you want to pull it down and then you create this nice little envelope look and then you just complete it and then you add your washi tape now that was fun and now I'm hungry <laughs> don't forget to subscribe and join and then hit the like button also you'll find more information below about all the different things that I've created just for you mahalo thanks and peace be the journey